Hello everyone. Yesterday I created a video that explained a little bit about uh, inserting illustration pictures, shapes, icons, uh, smart art, screenshots, uh, things like that in uh, Microsoft Office 365. So I explain how whenever you insert one of these items your ribbon which is this part right here creates additional um, tabs okay so and I explained that when you click on those tabs it gives you additional tools so one thing that I wanted to talk to y'all yesterday but I got distracted because my phone kept on ringing so I forgot to talk to y'all about when you have photos I showed I showed you how to wrap photos around items and I showed you how to do some cropping but you know all this <clears throat> I, I created this little presentation uh, those photos really don't pertain to the presentation itself I just wanted to show you what you can do with this so this photo here when you go into insert um, pictures and then you go into cut out people okay so that that particular photo was found in in uh in one of this different um selections so and I don't see him but all, actually all of those all of them were um, picked up from from that list also this little uh, symbols so or I think they call them icons um, so on this particular one <clears throat> when you find him in those uh, stock photos he actually looks like that so if I go in here and go crop see there's nothing under his hands right whereas if you look at this four people I couldn't find photos that only showed from the waist up so if I go in here and I right click and tell it to crop you can see there are additional oops excuse me uh, let me click here and then crop see you see all this I cropped that out of there so let me show you how I did that okay so uh, actually this would have to go about right there okay so if you click out of it so this is what it looked like so you can actually go in there and crop let's say that you didn't you didn't even want his hat all you wanted to show is from this ta uh, tablet down right if you you have two options you can right click and crop and then see you have to be careful like you see that that uh, arrow you don't want to use that arrow okay because that's gonna skew it what you want to do is go down just a little bit until you see that that symbol right there then you can crop and you can tell if you crop in because it kind of fades out the other part and you release it'll still look the same until you click away from it okay so that is how you can crop items now I can enlarge I can make it smaller so this items were actually real 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 not real real it was the size of a page okay so this photographs are um, um, huge Another thing 
um, that I forgot to show y'all was how to bring in this uh, symbols. No, actually, I did show y'all that. Never mind. But I, I, I brought this um, this little shapes. So the way I did that, <clears throat> I went in here and I found some shapes that I thought that would work with what I had. For instance, if I click down here, I'm going to move in this area and I'm going to put that symbol in there for her, right? Now, if I don't, you see how it's this thing here, I want it closer to her brain or her mouth. I could go in here and uh, you see if you go to rotate you flip horizontal now this thing is closer to to her you can skew it also you can skew this thing to make it look different or you can go in here you see the background you can see right uh, through it you can fill the background with white okay that way you could actually uh, put some text inside there. And right now it seems like the font is a different color. So I, I, it, it was white because we, to we told it the inside to be white. So it told the uh, text to be white. And you can go in here and enlarge it. Okay. Uh, I'm using com uh, commands, but you can go in here and select the con the size of text that you want. Okay, so that I just wanted to show y'all that. Hopefully, this will kind of help you out whenever you're wanting to create your own little presentations. Thank you for watching my video. Y'all have a great day and I will see you on the next video.